This is my audience, my son. I wanted to inform you today about the Nissan Rogue. My name is Michelle Welsh and I am in speech 110 and this is an informative speech. I did a little research on the Nissan Rogue. The Nissan Rogue is one of Nissan's premier vehicles. It is considered a compact SUV. I took the liberty of comparing, since I am interested and I hope you will come away being interested as I have, as going to Nissan's website, different websites like Edmunds.com, Cars Direct, to get some feedback and reviews on it. I had Nissan send me a brochure. This brochure gives all the information about the Rogue and shows where I got my research from. And the stats that I compared were three different vehicles that I would have been interested in purchasing. And what I wanted to inform you was on was my choice. My choice became the Nissan Rogue in comparison to the BMW X1, the Acura RDX. The length is comfortable, it's not oversized, it's not too long, it's 182.9 inches. Width, it's two inches wider than your average car at 70.9 inches. Height, it's not too tall where you would feel uncomfortable stepping in or out of the vehicle at 66 inches. Mileage is great. 21 point, 20, 20, excuse me, 21 in, 21 mile city and 27 highway, which is excellent. The horsepower, one, 170, over 6,000 RPMs, and your torque is it's not shabby for a four cylinder, is 175. The wheelbase, 105.9, and this is an all wheel drive vehicle. At price at $27,000, the weight is not as heavy as some all wheel drive vehicles would be, it's at 3,600 pounds. What I found interesting was for the price, there were so many uh, things looking at the specifications. <coughs> looking at the specifications in the book, it will show you that you get so many standard features where other vehicles would actually charge you and consider these as options. Some of the options that I think I would like to have, and I'm pretty sure some of you would like to have, is navigation, Bluetooth, uh, internal outlets for your iPad, your iPod, um, the console for storage right in between the two front seats, which are bucket seats, is wide enough to hold a laptop, ladies' purses. It's just a comfortable all-around vehicle. You can have aluminum or wood grain trim on the interior. There are several colors, black, blue, red, silver, generic colors but standard in the industry, which makes this car appealing to everyone. Um, some of the things that Nissan says is 10 reasons to make this your robe. 10, 10 reasons to make your robe is the advanced air, airbag. You have eight airbags going around. You have a curtain to the side. The curtain on the side is to protect for rollover, which is a great feature. Um, when SUVs started becoming popular, that was a indicator that they should put the airbags on the side. Some of the colors to show you. And I kind of informed myself. I went to the websites and looked, and you know, it was a treat to go out to the websites to actually look at the vehicles and test and feel it. Uh, there's a choice of leather and or cloth interiors, and both come in gray or black. My color choice is black with beige interior. The road is for all ages. It's fun to drive. It's fun to drive, it's comfortable, and you can accommodate your stroller, your car seats, as well as your luggage. The Rogue is fit for all generations, man, woman, family. It's very comfortable, and I think this is going to be my choice. Out of the BMW and the Acura, there were just so many things that I wanted to have that were overpriced options instead of what the Nissan Rogue was offering as standard material. Now, hopefully I'll be buying my new Nissan Rogue in another month. I hope I've informed you enough to go out and purchase the new redesigned Rogue.